Hello and welcome back to the Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. We're back in the Wind Temple with our boy Tulin here. So, if you remember from the last one, Zelda, uh, or like a false image of Zelda, was right here. She looks like she went through this. This is active now. So I'm going to see what this, what this does and we're going to continue on. So it activated some sort of sigil. Oh, there's the gears are moving. Oh, they lock into place. Okay. So that one's trying to open up, but it can't. Only, oh, only one of the gears are moving. Okay. I guess we have to get all the gears moving. And then it'll open up. Oh, what's happening now? That sound. There it is again. Brave Fletchling. There are still five locks securing the hatch on the deck. Use your power to release all five locks, and the hatch should open. Heed my words. I heard it for sure this time. It was calling out to me loud and clear. The source of the blizzard messing up the village has got to be under this hatch. Uh, yep, that is definite. If we find that voice was right, it'll open once we find a way to release all five locks. So we're close. Let's figure out how to open those locks. Yep, let's do that for sure. It looks like he marked the locks on my map. So basically we just get these locks open and it's going to open this up, which I'm assuming might be like where the main boss is for this area or something. Oh, we got a uh, frost choo-choo dude here. Let's just kill it right quick. I don't like the frost ones. If you get too close to them, you'll get the, uh, the unbearable code, which really messes you up. It looks like there's one right inside of here. I'm not sure what I'm looking for, but maybe in here? Yeah, it's in there, but how do I get in there? Uh, maybe I can like climb it or something? Okay, so there's this right here, which has a laser door that I can't get in. That door is blocked off as well. That's, that's good. I'm glad all the doors in this area are blocked off where I can't use them. That's a really nice feature. I could try climbing though. Oh, another choo-choo. Let me kill this one right quick too. All right, so maybe we're supposed to go in here instead. No, this one's closed too. We can open, we can like ultra hand this, but I don't think it does anything. Oh, it did open that though. Okay, so if I could find a way in there, I could do that. Um, maybe like I have to go around it or something. Oh, we got a, uh, got a Zonite dude here. I will take that strong construct bow, for sure. I was at the point in the last episode where I literally like did, almost didn't even have a bow. So, any bows I can get right now are well worth it. Okay, yeah, well, I walked all the way around it. Um, I wonder, is this? This is still part of the ship, isn't it? Behind here? Well, maybe not. By the time I get up it, it's probably not nothing. So, what do I do? Let's, let's ascend up here. Okay, and now that we're up here... Oh, this is moving. Is that like a cannon that's trying to kill me? 
Possibly. Yeah, this is definitely trying to kill me. So, what do I do? That is the question. Maybe it's something to do with this, because I think this still, yeah, this still goes on. So maybe we're supposed to climb up here? And go across? Yeah, look at that. Okay, wait. We can't get in here, though, can we? Yeah, there's no way in there. Alright. Um. In that case, maybe I'm supposed to go down here somewhere? Be like underneath it. No. Huh. Okay, the only thing I can think of is that I climb like this on the other side, and uh, that one door that I opened up, maybe it'll let me in there from like down here on that side. Yeah, because that's the very bottom of the ship there. Okay, so let's go all the way back around. Be nice if I could just like get in this place from up here somehow. That'd be really handy if I could do that. All right, so we're back over here a little bit. Oh, I hear something. Oh, there's another choo choo. So I'm guessing over time these guys respawn. I think I may have found my way in. Alright, cool. So now we gotta burn that. Which I don't have any sort of fire whatsoever. But what I do have are bombs. So let's just blow it up. Or not. Wow, bombs don't even blow it up. Are you kidding me? I have one flame emitter. So I guess what I'm going to do is I'm going to take it out. And throw it on one of my shields. Uh, we'll do... We'll do this shield, sure. Okay, now what? Can I hit this or something? Oh, I ultra hand it, don't I? Yeah, I ultra hand it. Okay, so that opened that door. A Zonite shield, look at that. I literally can't even carry it. I'll leave it there for now. I may need it later. What's funny is I don't think this was even the correct spot. Unless I'm supposed to ascend up. Which could be what I'm supposed to do. Okay. So yeah, that turns out that wasn't what I was supposed to do, after all. Who knew? Certainly not me.
And there was nothing to do in here. This is where the, uh, that's where that is. So there's got to be a way to that. I feel like that's the main thing here is to just figure out how to activate that thing. Maybe there's like an ice spot over here I can go down in. I don't see nothing like that over here, but you never know. I don't think... Oh, is that ice right there? No, I don't think that's ice. Come on, Link. Get up there. Yeah, no, that's not gonna do nothing. Am I supposed to do something with this thing? Like, do I, like, somehow deactivate this thing? Or control it? I really don't know. This temple makes no sense, and I just fell. After all that work I did of getting up here. Huh. Gotta be something. There is another thing I can burn right here. We'll try that and see what that does. It literally just had a bow inside it. Okay, well, I am stumped. I have no idea. It shows me where they are, too, which is weird. It says one is, like, in here. One's supposed to be, like, right here. One there, one here. Let's go this way a bit. And the other way. There's supposed to be one there, and then there's supposed to be something like right up here, like right here. Oh, I see there's a switch here. I did not pull that switch. Okay. I finally figured something out. So that opened this door. Making a little bit of progress. And I need to save this shield, actually, because I'm probably going to have to melt more ice. Flame emitter spear. I need that. Let me drop this wooden stick, and we're going to pick that up. All right. So now that we got that, uh, it looks like it literally didn't do a thing but open up a door for a chest. Yeah. Which is great. So let's see if we ascend. Where do we go? There, but there's another ice thing. I... I don't know. Cause it's odd, but it's showing it behind this door. And then there's one like back here, one here, and then one inside of there. But I don't know how to get to any of them. Hooks. Hooks. 
Maybe I can pick up this ice pick and then use it as like a, uh, like fuse it with this. Like maybe now I can turn it? Wow, that actually worked. Okay, that opened up one door. Alright, so we got a fan, it looks like. Hey, Tulin, come here. Do you need to blow this? Yeah, it's definitely a lock shaped like a windmill. Can I get you to blow this, Tulin? Tulin, come here. Hey, Tulin. Come here. Blow that. There we go. Alright, so that's one of the five locks. Well, actually, two of the five. No, it's, th it's one. Hey, yeah, there were six total. This thing opened one of the locks. We gotta find the other four. Yeah, we gotta find the other four for sure. Alright, so now that one of the locks is open, that probably opens some sort of door. I hope that opens some sort of door. I don't think it's going to do anything if I push this button, but I'm going to push it anyways. Yeah, no, it doesn't do anything. Okay. So I got one of the hatches. These two, I still don't know where they are. And I don't know how to get to that one in here. So I'm still really stumped. It says that one is like right here. Ain't no way I just figured out like a big secret to this place on my own like that. That's pretty cool. Which I've been doing everything on my own, but that's pretty cool. Alright, so literally there was that. Oh, there's a bunch of lasers. Oh, great. I'm probably gonna die. Okay, what do I do? Oh, I go in here, I take it. Yep, yeah, there's another one right here. Alright, Tulin. Leave it to me. Come on. Alright, there's two of the five. And there's a chest right there. It's hard to get this chest. There, okay. Soldier blade. Ooh. I kind of want that. Let's get rid of this uh, sturdy stick. Oh, yeah. So the cool thing about uh, weapons like this... If you take a, if you, so if you push a Y on the switch, you can actually sort stuff by attack power. And if you drop something like, let's say there's a blue Lizzle Fang, it says it does 16 attack power. So now if you fuse it, to like, let's say the Soldier Blade, oh, never mind, you can't. But if you do it to like certain weapons, like this thick stick here, for instance, that would have like upped the damage by 16, which is really good. Somehow I avoided every laser. Don't know how I did that, but I did. Okay, so that's all of the ones on this side. 
So now the rest of them are in the middle and over there. Okay, so this is interesting. Just one second, let me pick this bow up. I don't really want that five one. All right, so it looks to me like, so on the first floor is this one. On the basement first floor is that one. And then on the basement second floor is that one. Now, how in the world do I get to the basement? Cause it's got it like right here. But the reason why I couldn't get to it before is it's in the basement. Which means that more than likely that one that's behind that ladder, which is this one. I mean, uh, this one over here, I believe. Yeah, this one. Which we go in from over here somehow. That probably leads us into the basement. But the question is, how do I get into there? I want to take that strong construct bow, but I have this one with durability up, so I'm actually going to just leave that there in case I need it in the future. I probably won't, but just in case. So there has to be some sort of way of getting there, but how? Because literally, there's the fan right there. Is there like a gap in the roof or something? Yeah, I think I could just like fuse this bar thing to my weapon. Like, I can pick this up. I can't really do anything with it, but I can pick it up. There's got to be a way to get into it somehow. Because you come up from down there. Which means that you would need to be able to get down there to begin with. So how would I get down there? Let's see what melting this does. It's just a chest. Zonite spear, okay. Well, I guess it's a little bit better than the uh, blade, so I'll take it, why not? How in the world? Do I get below? There's no way I like jump off this thing and then like, yeah, no. It's all on the ship. Oh, like I'm almost positive on that. There's no way I, they would make me go down. Well, they might, there's a cannon aimed down. Maybe I am supposed to go down there and like work my way up somehow. 
Because they do have the they do have the cannon aiming. Oh, it just fired. And it missed whatever it was trying to hit. Okay, you know what? Uh, we can bounce up from the pirate ships if we need to come back up here. Let's jump down and we're gonna see what happens. After, apparently, we get attacked by an Aracuda. Where did it go? Did you kill it, Tulin? Nice. Tulin, you did something awesome. Okay, this is probably a dumb idea. Yeah, I don't think it's going to do anything. I really don't think it's going to do anything. Okay, yeah, we're not going to do that after all. Oh, hello. Look at that, a secret entrance. So it was a good idea to come down there. Okay, now we're in the basement. I missed completely. Okay, so there's a chest right there. Let me see if I can get that. <laughs> Let's see what's in this chest. A ruby. Okay, that's not bad. Alright, so we got through there. There's nothing this way, but we have to go in here to get to the uh, one that's right here. So we're going to go down. Oh, this is the second floor now. Okay. So I guess we're going to keep going down. Or not. The door's closed. Do these do anything? I doubt it, but... Yeah, they don't do anything. Okay. <laughs> Tulin, I'm gonna need a boost. I did not want to jump down further. Well, I guess I did. I found, I found a uh, thing. Wow. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Nice. I found that. Totally what I wanted to do. Come on, Tulin. Come here. Two to go. That is true. Alright, so I'm assuming that I can get to where the ladder is to go back to the first floor from down here somehow. I wouldn't see why I couldn't. Yeah, that opened the door for right here. So I can go through there again. Okay. This is still 
blocked, whatever goes there. But that's fine because I need to go, it looks like all the way around all of this or something to get into this room. Doing good, how are you? Uh, it's going all right so far. I'm just trying to figure out how to do this wind temple. shield. Okay. Thank you. Okay, Tulin. So, um, there's two more that I have to activate. I'm guessing I ascend up here? Yeah. More than likely I ascend up here. Uh, no thanks. Not right now, Nancy. But I do appreciate it, though. Oh, a chest, wow. It attaches with... Uh, if I decide to, Nancy, I'll let you know. Right now, uh, I'm just kind of playing and enjoying myself. Now, how do I activate this? Maybe I attach this to it? I don't know. I don't think I have one. I have no idea how to. Oh, so uh, the Twitter is actually the same as my Twitch. It's uh, Bushido Code 24. That's how you get to that. First floor. Hmm. I've got most of this temple, but I can't figure this one part out.
All right, cool. Okay, here's one of the final ones. I think I have... I messed that up. I gotta wait for it to recharge now. I think I'll have one more left after this one. Yeah, sure, Nancy. I'll follow you back as soon as I finish streaming here. That is correct. And it is in the basement of the first floor. On that side. The question is how in the world to get to it? Because I can't go back down there now. Um, I am not sure. I'm, I'm just kind of playing until I decide to stop. Probably another half hour or so. Yeah, sure. Like I said, as soon as I'm done, I'll uh, do that. Now, how do I get to this last fan so that I can open this up? It's like right in there, and I just can't... I can't get to it from here, can I? Can I, like, open this up and it do it? I don't think I can. I think I still need the other fan to open this up. Yeah, no, they don't open yet. Okay, I got in there from here the last time, so I'm guessing I do the same thing on this side to get in over there for the final fan. Okay, there's definitely a door, but the problem is that it's closed. Yeah, and there's a set of gears that operate it and make it open. Great. Now, how in the world do I...
Okay, I am really stuck right now, but I think I might have figured out my solution. There's a little hole down here that I don't think I went in yet. I Well, that might be where that fan was from the other one. I know there's that way right there, which gets me over here. But I need like on this side so that I can get to where the gear and stuff is. So maybe... Like, I don't know, because this goes here. But I'm, I'm going to try going down here. I'm gonna, this is probably that other fan, but... Yeah, this is that other fan. Oh, dang. It's fine, though, because maybe I can just ascend up. No, can't descend up. Well, that sucks. Um, okay. Let's see here. Maybe I can go on this air, this um, ship here and like bounce my way up somehow. While this cannon fires at me to try to kill me. Let's fire a fire fruit at this ice wall and see what that does. But I, ha I think I, ha I know I have one. Yeah, there we go. I missed. I bet it that ice wall is where I go. Question is, how do I get to it? Okay, I got an idea, so let's do this. 
Now we're going to fire a fire arrow straight at it. And let's fire a bomb. Did that do anything? That did do something, okay. Now maybe this is where I go to get in here at. This is like the only area of this place I haven't went in yet. Okay, so I got that, but where's the thing? Okay, so it looks like, yeah. Let's recall this to go over. So here's the switch. Okay, cool. So that will get me into there. Is there anything over here? Yeah, there's a set of gears. So let's turn this one. Or not. Let's turn this one, maybe? It looks like it's missing a gear, possibly. So how in the world do I, like, fill it in? Um, it, I'm, I know that opening this did something, because it, it gave me, like, the little sound for it. So... Maybe I take this one? No, I can't take that one. Uh, let's see here. What do I do? Let me look around. Okay, maybe I can, like, bring one of these down? Yeah. I wonder if this would work. I can just, like, stick it in between here. I think it's too long. I, I don't know if that's gonna work. It might. It does, actually. It works, like, kind of perfect, actually. Okay, cool. All right, Tooling, come here. Leave it to me. And there we go. All five locks are open. That's it, Link. We've unlocked them. Alrighty, so we've unlocked all of the locks. Yep, we can definitely open up the main hatch now. Cool. Which means it's probably about to be time for a boss fight. So now how do we get back to the uh, area for that is the question. Maybe I just go back through here? Or maybe that's what this was for, was to just simply... Yeah, it's to just simply fly back over. Yeah, that's just the easy way to get back. Okay. All right, cool. So now that we did that, I can open up the door here and we're gonna see what happens next. Oh, 
Oh, wow, it blew us way up in the air. Oh, crap. What is that? Kolgura? That's the source the of the wind temple. The yeah, that thing's definitely causing the blizzard. Am I fighting it like right now? Yes, I'm fighting it right now. Okay. I missed. Do I go down, maybe? Can I find it on the ground? I'm supposed to hit the uh, purple spots, aren't I? I guess I do have to do it from there. Oh, they're made of ice. They're, of course they're made of ice. And I can't shoot that far. What? Where'd it go? Yeah, where did it go? Link, below you. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. It tried to eat me. Um... What in, how in the world do I find this thing? I would assume I hit this ice spot, but I don't know. Need to find a way to hurt it. Broke the ice on its face, but oh, here we go. I guess I need to. I don't know why it's not hitting. I, okay, let me do a, a key swing. Key swing, shoot further. There we go. Let's do that. That'll break it. Let's keep firing these key swings. There we go. We hit one of them. Hey, that worked. Yes, it did. Let's keep firing key swings at it. My bow broke. That's that's always nice when my bow breaks. All right. Keep firing these key swings. There we go, we got two spots on it. All right, so now I need it to like turn back around or something. Oh boy. Okay, that's still open now. Let me see if I can get closer. Okay, it just came back. Probably even stronger. And it's got tornadoes. And I'm falling from the sky. Great. <laughs> Be careful. 
Yeah, no flying away for sure. Okay, how in the world do I kill this thing? I guess it's the same way, but I have to avoid the tornadoes. Don't get too close to the tornadoes. Yeah, I know. I'm not gonna be able to hit that far. I'm gonna heal a little bit while I have a chance. Um, let's do this mighty attack boost one. Got a minute and a half. I can attack. No, oh, nice. Do I got another key swing? I have an electric one, that'll work. No, not the eyeball, the key swing. There we go, I think I might have killed it that time. Yeah, it just blew up. Nice. Awesome. So maybe Rito Village is saved now? Yep, it looks like the storm is lifting. That's good. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It looks so much better now. And there's a heart... So, I'm getting an extra free heart, it looks like. The ice is melting. And what is that? Is that a dragon tear? Let's grab the heart container. So that's going to increase my hearts by one, yep. Let's talk to Tulin. Okay, Tulin, what is this? Is this a dragon tear or what? from a time long ago. I proudly served Hyrule's first king. I was a Rito warrior and a sage with control of the wind. Where you fight, the winds follow. I would expect nothing less from my descendant. You make me proud. That monster you defeated, the source of that intense blizzard, it was summoned by the Demon King. He thought he could stop you from obtaining the stone you just found. My secret stone. Demon King? Secret stone? 
This is a lot to learn all of a sudden. I know. But listen while I tell you what happened in the past. A tale of the imprisoning war. And the mission our people must accomplish. Years ago, when the kingdom of Hyrule was still young, a great evil, the Demon King, descended on the land. He sought to wipe out anyone who opposed him. But Raru, the first king of Hyrule, requested my aid, as well as that of five other warriors, to help in the fight. Raru entrusted us with amazing artifacts, secret stones, objects that amplified our formidable abilities. I carried one into battle as the Sage of Wind. It was thrilling to fight alongside my fellow Wow, that's sages. really cool. Yet so Raru had the the Demon King's overwhelming power. Oh wow! His magic was staggering, and I was unable to slip past his defenses, no matter how hard I tried. In the end, King Raru realized that we would not be able to defeat the Demon King. To save our world, King Raru sacrificed himself and sealed the Demon King away. So that was the imprisoning war. The rest of us survived that climactic battle, and I would soon receive a visitor with a request that would define the future of the Rito. It's Zelda. It was another of the six sages, the Sage of Time. The Demon King will return. The magic binding him will be undone. When that time comes, a noble swordsman named Link will oppose him. Link will only succeed with the Rito's help. Summon the winds and support this hero. It was clear what part the Rito would play. It will be an honor to defeat the Demon King. I swear to you that when the Demon King returns, the Rito Sage of Wind will awaken once more. And you can count on the full support of the Rito. Now you know about the imprisoning war, and a mission I accepted on our behalf. You've saved Rito Village, but there's more to do. The Demon King will soon recover his full strength. Tulin, my brave fledgling, you must take up my secret stone and honor the Sage of Time's request. Fight the Demon King. With the swordsman Link. So it's my mission to fight the Demon King with you? Link! This is so, so amazing! I can't believe my ancestor gave me such an important mission. And it involves fighting alongside you to save the world! If we don't do anything, then the world is gonna be in big trouble. I can't let that happen. I'll do this! I'll happily take this secret stone! Okay, so Tulin's getting the secret stone back that King Raru left. And I'm guessing he's joining us to fight uh, the Demon King Ganondorf. Question is, though, is he going to be like a permanent party member or like what's going to be going on? Look, check out what, I can do now. what can you do now? Anything different? Oh. Wind, 
swore to fight by your side until the end. Take this. It's proof that I'm with you. So he just gave me his like avatar that he summoned basically. So can I just call the thing at will or something? Like like that'd be cool. How does it work exactly? Did I gain another power? Oh, Rink got a ring. Uh, Link got a got a ring. I guess that means they're official now. that ring to call on my power anytime so i can right. do it anytime okay cool that's awesome okay let's head back to the village and tell dad okay cool so yeah we can uh pretty much looks like summon the uh power whenever we want which is really cool So that is definitely going to come in handy. Oh, there's more. Okay. Hmm? Uh -huh. Looks like the ice melted on Rito Village. That's awesome. So I'm guessing Tulin's gonna go tell his dad now that we've uh, beat the big bad guy. You guys, you did it. <laughs> Turns out it was easy once we started working together. This was no small feat. I still can't believe the swordman, the storm wind arc from the children's song was real <laughs> me neither you could have knocked me over with a feather hmm. oh he's given Tulin his bow wow wait what this bow meant so much to you and now you're giving it to me yeah to and it's a sign that you've like grown up basically and he's accepted you as like a full-fledged warrior hopefully that bow does more than two damage like yours does it probably does three damage <laughs> I'll prove to you that I've become a warrior worthy of carrying it. Hmm. Hey Link, that woman in the vision my ancestors showed us, didn't she look just like Princess Zelda to you? That's because she was Princess Zelda. I mean, it seemed like a long, long time ago. Hmm. There's still a bunch of unanswered questions. I've got to know more about the figure we saw in Stormwind Arc, so I'm going to go look into it personally. Next time you see me, I'll have more information about Princess Zelda, so check in with me sometime, okay? Mm. And remember, with my Sage's power, the two of us can keep working together no matter what. Okay, we got the Vow of Tulin, Sage of the Wind. We can use it to summon or dismiss the Avatar of Tulin. So that is really cool. And the Tulin of Rito Village main story mission is now complete. 
And with that, I think this is a good spot to end this stream at. Uh, we have now successfully finished Rito Village. And we'll be making our way to one of the other three areas in my next one.